At Girl Talk HQ, we are all about promoting role models and inspiring young women who are doing amazing things in their industries. So today, we've come down to sunny Manhattan Beach, California for the Element Eden Trunk Show to hang out with Jack Vanek, who is one talented designer that you guys need to know about. We're here at the Element Eden Trunk Show. Now you've been guest designing for them for a while and yep. you're customizing t-shirts for them. Yep. That's one of your specialties, right? Yeah, um, I do it on the side. Um, I've always like cut my t-shirts since I was like 15. Because yeah. I'd always just get like crappy band t-shirts and I hated how they fit. So I'd always like cut them into crazy tank tops and like backless, halter tops. So I've just been doing it forever. So when you started out selling your wristband bracelets, you went to music festivals. Yeah. And how was that like being in this big, huge event? Well, it was such a weird thing because, especially like at the Warped Tour and stuff, yeah. it's very male dominated right. and women are not, women, girls are not really taken that seriously. Yeah. So it was very, very hard kind of overcoming that and like proving to people that I'm serious and this like is a real business for me. It's not like me trying to get backstage or me trying to just hook like up make with a guys quick or, buck or yeah. yeah, hook up with guys. So it was definitely like, a long time of kind of proving it to everybody that you know like what I was doing was serious. So what else are we going to see from you? Um, I'm just diving into the world of cut and sew, so a lot of uh, garments, pants, kimonos, dresses, so going beyond just t-shirts. I'm sick of awesome. just doing t-shirts. Really? <laughs> yeah. Now with the slogans on your t-shirts, like this is one of my favorites, quit your day job. Yup, um, good one. Sorry for what I said when I was hungry <laughs> and the difference between my, uh, your opinion and pizza is that I asked for pizza. Yeah. That's one of my favorites too. It's How do you one. come up with these sayings? And it's not just to be controversial, is it? Oh, no, not at all. I mean, there's so much bad fashion out there, and right. there's so many just badly thought out t-shirts and stuff, and I, I don't know, I'm a sassy, sarcastic person, yeah. so it's just stupid shit that I've thought of, and I'm like, this would be funny. So how do you kind of keep going when people are negative and, you know, maybe people doubt what you're doing, or you doubt yourself, like, how do you keep going with what you love? It just comes back to really not taking myself too seriously, because in, I don't know, in getting down on myself, I used to always read all, like, the negative comments online and, like, yeah. all that, and there's just no point, like, can't do that. Yeah. So what message do you have to young women out there who obviously love what you do and you're their hero and role model? What would you say to them to, I guess, inspire them? Oh, okay. Like the one piece of advice that I can give anybody is just do what your heart tells you to do. Try not to let anybody else get to you because people are always going to have some kind of opinion. And as long as you truly believe in what you're doing and you're following your passion and just being real to yourself, then that's all that matters. All right, Jackson, what's next for you? Um, I'm doing a, a couple other music festivals, um, Riot Fest in Chicago, and then I'm just designing away, locking myself up in my room, yeah. and getting some new stuff out. Well, Jack, thanks so much for hanging out with me. This has been super awesome. Yeah. I know all my Girl Talk HQ readers are going to totally love what you have to say. And don't forget to follow Jack. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, it's just her name. Go to jackvanek.com to uh, check out more of her t-shirts as well. Awesome. See you guys. Bye.